குட் மார்னிங் அயாம் கோயம்புத்தூர் திருமூலர் சித்திரபீடம் சிவயோகி சிவராஜன் ஸ்பீக்கிங் நவீ டேஸ் மெனி பர்சன்ஸ் ஆர் டீச்சிங் முத்ராஸ் முத்ரா தெராபி தே வில் சிம்ப்ளி சே யூஸ் திஸ் முத்ரா தென் தேட் ரிசல்ட் வில் கம் சிம்ப்ளி யூஸ் திஸ் திஸ் முத்ரா தென் தேட் டிசீஸ் வில் கோ அவே பட் பிஃபோர் தேட் தேர் ஆர் சர்டன் ரூல்ஸ் அண்ட் ரெகுலேஷன்ஸ் then only the mudras can work the even the mudra therapist should follow that because mudras are the sealing mudra means sealing this is an art and science of combining panchabhuta elements in your body we are having five elements in your body and with these five ten fingers you can manipulate concentrate then you can direct the energy and redirect the energy to different parts of your body different organs different glands this is a very subtle art the knowledge of panchabhuta is very very essential for this mudra therapy therapists also so how to manipulate before the using these mudras this the hand manipulation is only the last stage the people are teaching the last stage and asking you to do that mudra that will cure you do this mudra that will cure but before that the first this is directing astral current you have to create you have to absorb astral current from the cosmos around your body your physical body is also having cosmic energy but there is a cosmic energy around you from that you have to absorb uh, uh, cosmic energy so for mudra therapy the first requirement is one has to activate their adharas and make it chakras for that also you need mudras to open up the chakras adharas then only they will start absorbing the cosmic energy around you the cosmic energy is having all five elements energy in the subtle form the cosmic energy is having earth energy water energy agni air all in in that energy in the form of sound and color so you have to absorb the energy first take the energy inside your body first proceed this chakra activation and you have to cleanse the panchabhudas in your body because the panchabhuda energy in your body is um, polluted with many a wrong food pattern or air pollution water pollution all these things for all the bone muscle skin hair all are dominating with the earth elements and blood sweating urine they are dominate with the water elements and the heat portion is dominated with the agni elements we are inhaling exhaling air that is influenced by air element but all are polluted you are not getting pure energy in this so cleansing of this panchabhudas in your body is are very very essential before using mudra mudra therapy the mudras are special mudras are there to cleanse the panchabhuda elements in your body in the astral level so there are mudra there are procedure there are mantras mantras are means energy formula sound energy formulas combined with mudras can alone work cleanse the panchabhuda in your body after that you have to store the astral current panchav cosmic energy in your body the storage places are the dasa vayus the name is dasa vayus but there are 15 vayus in siddha literature you have to store that absorbed energy in this dasa vayus there are certain mantras and mudras for storing them in your bodies 
after that only you have to discharge through the nadi channels meridians there are 96 energy channels in your body that carry this astral current this nadi channels and channels are different from nerves nerves you are having 1.25 lakh nerve units they carry bio current but this 96 nadi channels carry this astral current the astral current you can absorb through chakra activation you store in the dasa wise and then you direct through the 96 channels to directing that also you are having certain mudras and mandras you are directing and it goes to different parts of your body and clears your ailments and based on this to manipulate this energy is the secret of varma acupressure also acupuncture also works on this manipulation of this energy flow so you have to do all these first then only you have to go to um, doing these mudras the mudras through mudras you are um, uh, combining by um, these five elements and from this the energy goes return it, uh, it goes back to the chakras and we can direct the energy to different parts of your body and organs. So the, the mudras used by therapists, mudras advised by all people are at the last stage one. But these uh, mudras, if you do not uh, open up the mudras, if you do not cleanse it, if you do not store in the other, if you do not direct the energy outward, how can one, the outer mudras work? These mudras, hand mudras used by therapists are the last one, last type. They cannot work without the previous three exercises. So the mudra therapy should also cleanse his and the body and open up the chakras, direct or it, direct it. So if they teach the persons to do that mudra for this disease and uh, it will not work and even if sometimes it may work 2%, 3% because some persons have, may have this astral current in their body due to some meditation or this some other exercise. For all others, they have to do all these procedures, then only mudras will work. Moreover, the mudra therapist and the institutes, they constantly they say only about the finger hand mudras. Actually, the most powerful mudras are above neck mudras. Above neck mudras, you are having a lot of mudras. Kesari mudra, Sambhavi mudra, Agasi mudra. And there are a lot of mudras. Tip of nose gazing, crow bead, Agasi mudra, Sunya mudra. The many mudras are they work very fast are very powerful after that there are some mudras combined with the asanas vivarida garani mudra karna veda mudra and there are many more mudras mandukya mudra these are asana combined mudras they are also very powerful then um, this uh, pranayama combined mudras adi mudra brahma mudra all the, there are mudras they are combined with this uh, breathing and kumbaha and all these things and finally only this comes the hand mudras so mudra therapist and uh, if i use only the hand mudras i recommend that so the uh, powerful mudras also should be combined and a mudra having all these powerful mudras alone will work fast. So mudra cure needs energy flow and enhancement in your body first. Then only you can manipulate the energy. So without uh, um, creating, without observing energy, the mudra cure will not work. So first requirement, even for the mudra therapy should activate their own adharas store the energy in a good condition and open up the channels and direct the energy to 
different parts. This is needed not only for mudra therapies, it is also needed for varma asans, reiki masters and prani healers. So these bandhas are also in certain way mudras. And they, they, they should be combined together and they should be used according to the age and the timing. The energy flow in the body up to 10, uh, 10 o'clock in the morning will be different with it. and 10 to 2 the energy flow will be different and they, from um, uh, 2 to uh, 6 the energy will be different. So in the morning session the energy will be dominating with the Pitta and from the afternoon Bhada element will be more and this evening Kaba element will be more. So the mudra therapies should take into account this also because Panjabudas are reclassified into Vada Pitta Kaba. Vada Pitta Kaba um, three items are the classification, reclassification of the five elements. So you are in mudra, you are curing, you are combining the Panjabudha elements through your hands. So the energy flow um, uh, in the morning, afternoon, the evening should be taken into account before using these mudras. Otherwise, it may work uh, in the wrong way. So, if you want to clear this um, uh, pitta, then you, you have to do these uh, mudras in the morning. For clearing vada, rheumatism and all these things, you have to use the mudras from 10 to 2 o'clock. For control of kaba or kaba related disease, you have to use the mudra from um, um, this uh, uh, two to six. The many in the same way, if you want to use the mudras at night, the same order should repeat. So uh, there are so many subtle things for taking into consideration before combining, before prescribing a package of mudras for mudra cure, mudra therapy. So the knowledge of a chakra activation, varma, and the how to activate the rasa values, all these are needed, all these should be done before um, doing this mudra therapy. I am giving all details from the how to observe the energy, practical training, how to store the energy in your body, practical training I am giving, how to cleanse the panjabuddha elements in your I am giving. I am opening up Nadi Janas and directing the energy and finally only this mudra should be given. I am giving mudra prescription on that basis. So this is the in-depth study and this will alone will work and it will be sharp and with the immediate effect the diseases will be cured. For need contact me. Thank you.